Hello and welcome to GPM Global. My name is Anthony Della Porta and I'm on the executive team with GPM. And I'm here today to talk to you about our flagship course called PRISM, Projects Integrating Sustainable Methods. Now, this course has been put together by the GPM team to help us to understand as projects and program and portfolio managers integrating change, sustainable business change, and looking at integrating the sustainability mechanisms to understand how that change is impacting on the triple bottom line, as Elkington put it many years ago, the economic the environment and the social aspects of our, our operations and our environment around us. What are we doing that's going to impact on those through projects? And this is the ideal point to do that. As we put change into business, into operations, we need to understand what are we actually delivering from a product point of view, the project's product, how's that going to impact on those three areas, right? And also the processes we're putting in place to run the project, how they're going to impact on the organization and internally, right? And this has been put together in a document called the P5 standard, the GPM Global P5 standard. And this is one of the core documents that helps us integrate the mechanisms through our project and program delivery. It helps us measure the aspects of each of those particular elements of sustainability, uh, which we've broken down into smaller sections within the economic environment uh, and social areas to understand how they work. And the PRISM course looks at that part of the mechanism, the P5 standard, and how do we use that to recall the information through the sustainability management uh, plan throughout our projects. And on top of that, link them to some of the core ISO standards that we have in place, looking at corporate social responsibility, looking at the environment, and looking at the energy side of things, as well as looking at quality. So there are many standards that we're involved in that, and the supply chain standard, which is now being established as 24400 supply chain standard. These are all very important because we need to understand how they interact with each other and how they interact with other mechanisms as we deliver our projects to ensure that we deliver a project, not from a sustainable project point of view from delivering a green car, for instance, but how we run the project to deliver that car and the impact it's going to have around those main areas. And the other part we look at is the integration with the UN Global Compact and the 10 principles and align ourselves with the 17 sustainability development goals that come out of the Global Compact as well and come out of the UN. So the present course runs you through a full life cycle and stakeholder engagement. It looks at organizations and looks at the key areas and themes and techniques we need to incorporate through project delivery. So there are two parts to the PRISM course. The first one is the full course, the practitioner course. It assumes little or no great experience in projects to a certain extent, but also no formal qualifications to date, like PRINCE2, for example, or the Agile PM. Now, that takes you full through a full three or four day course, depending on the complexity you need to have. And it gives you enough information to be able to sit the GPM foundation exam to pass that and become a GPM foundation, uh, uh, GPM foundation, GPM, Green Project Manager, sorry. And that helps you to therefore establish yourself on that first level of our certification. There, there are three levels altogether. The first one is exam based, the next two are the practitioner and the masters are competency based. But getting back to the PRISM course, the PRISM course has the full practitioner level for those that need to have all the information and looks at things like conflict management and negotiation, etc., uh, resource management and other areas too that support that. Now, if you already have PRINCE2 practitioner or the Agile PM practitioner or other related uh, competency-based or uh, and skilled-based uh, exams through other methodologies or approaches, then the, you can take the shorter form course of the PRISM course. This just takes the key mechanisms of the PRISM methodology to wrap around your current methodology you have in place already to help you build your bigger toolkit and integrate that into your current approaches you have for your organization. No matter what it's based on, whether it's based on PRINCE2, Agile PM, or other, some, uh, other method and life cycle. So it looks how we integrate that into that. And this takes a shorter exam because the full course looks at 150 questions over a couple of hours. This one looks at 50 questions over one hour because it looks at just 
the integration of the sustainability elements that you need to have through the course because you already have the practitioner. So there are two sides to the PRISM course. Now, depending on what level you have, we look forward to seeing you on one of those courses and becoming a GPM, a Green Project Manager. And this will set you on a new course and give you the, uh, the PM advantage, we like to call it, providing you as a sustainable PM, giving you extra work and extra understanding how you drive yourself through projects, give you that edge. So all the information you will see going through the video here uh, will be afterwards. You can look at the greenprojectmanagement.org website under individuals, which gives you a lot more detail about the PRISM course. Look forward to seeing you on that course and getting you signed on as a GPM foundation. And thank you for listening. We wish you well.